Yeah, it's been very tight, a lot of hard tackling and you know, intriguing really, not, not, not as stylish as you might have expected, no score from play so far, but uh, still very interesting. As Shane McGraw wins that, huge one down towards Lark Corbett, he's got it, he scored! A goal by Lark Corbett! His 17th ever in Championship hurling, a crucial one here, coming after 10 minutes, and it's 1-3 to a point, it was a huge delivery. All of a sudden, Lark Corbett was one-on-one -on -one there. Beat his man, beat the goalkeeper, who put it into the back of the net. And there you saw the fullback exposed big time by Lark Corbett, beating Hickey, beat initially by Paddy Stagelum. And away it comes back up to the forwards again. Brilliantly caught by McGrath. On to Lark Corbett. They fire Hayley's at him, but nobody's able to stop Lark Corbett who's in for a second goal, one after ten minutes, another after 42, and it's Tipperary who lead the final by 2-11 to 110. As he was striking it, they were firing Hurleys to try and stop him, but nobody able to put paid to the gallop of the third of the star. He won an All-Ireland medal in 2001, and he's looking for another. Delaying the inevitable, Paul Maher, will be hoping to lead Tipperary's under-21s on Saturday next to another All-Ireland victory, boosted by this one here, as that ball is caught inside there by Patrick Maher, and it's swept in in the end, and it's finished in the back of the net, and there is another one for Tipperary, and for Liam Sheedy, and no, Lark Corbett has got a hat-trick in the 73rd minute. This is how he finished it all. Ma played it to him and Lark Corbett with three to make it 417 to 117 and it's a terrific day for the Premier County.